Let's follow an actual install of an AC disconnect, showing the steps similar to the simulation. Use a marking tool to mark off, in this case, the same three holes that we use to place the AC disconnect against the wall. And then you have to remove the box away from your marking so that you can drill into those holes. Then we use a drill driver with, I recommend, a carbide tip drill bit so that you can cut through the stucco without dulling that drill tip. You're going to drill in using the drill driver or an impact driver and make your holes. Then once you have your holes, you can insert your wall anchors. And in this case, the, this installer is using plastic stucco anchors. Um, in our simulation, we used metal wall anchors because we were going into brick. Now you're ready with your anchors in place. You're ready to replace back up the AC disconnect and use uh, screws or bolts, or like screws, to connect into your anchors uh, to secure it. And in this case, the installers use an impact driver. Uh, could use a drill driver and inserting uh, screws with washers into those wall anchors. Then in the process of installing it back up, you want to insert or put on a level to be able to make sure that you got it uh, set just right. In this case, the installer is just pushing it and making slight adjustments uh, using that uh, level. And we can see that he's checking it out, making sure that the device itself is nice and level. And that pretty much finishes it up. That's how you mount up the AC disconnect. Hey, thanks for watching the training video using Interplay's simulation-based training program. You can keep watching our solar videos by clicking on the link to your left, or stay up to date on our latest solar snacks by subscribing on your right. To learn more about how the STP provides critical team training and helps you build an onboarding program at your company, please go to interplaylearning.com.